The pasta, this is my favorite dish off the menu, and I love those buffalo chicken egg rolls. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, the rasta pasta is our jerk chicken pasta. It has red peppers, green peppers, red onions, and it's made with our homemade Alfredo jerk sauce. Um, yeah, <laughs> it's amazing, it's amazing, it's extremely popular. The chicken, the sauce, everything is definitely homemade. Yes, definitely. What is your favorite thing about working at Kay's Kitchen? My favorite thing about working here is just to spend time with my family because my, that's my auntie. Kay is my auntie. So I love spending time with my family and I also love talking to people. So this is a great job for me. What is your favorite item on the menu? My favorite, that's a hard question to ask, but one of my favorite items on the menu is our buffalo chicken egg rolls. Yes, them yeah, good. Yeah, I always suggest that to people every time they come here, they'll be like, yo, it's egg rolls? Like, no, it's really good. So that's one of my favorite things on the menu. If you're looking to start a business, don't be scared. Leap out on faith. I quit my job and I was making very good money working in corporate America, but it was worth it. Um, I'm doing something that I love. I'm working for myself and building a brand, so. Love it, yeah. Like girl magic. Started off with one sweatshirt. Mm -hmm. Literally one sweatshirt. And I sold it. And then I made two sweatshirts. And then I made my way up to 30 sweatshirts. I am here with Mikey from Don't no Try It. And we're gonna ask him some questions. So, you ready? Sure. Okay, top three uh, favorite designers that top you would like to favorite. work with. Heidi Slimane, Virgil, uh, ooh, that third one crazy, uh, <laughs> Kirby Raymond. How did you pick the name? Where did that come from? Um, it actually sounded like don't try it, mm -hmm. you know what I'm saying? But like, it was mainly because there was a lot of people telling me like, don't do that by yourself, you know what I'm saying, just stick to the good thing. Mm -hmm. But I had my own vision, so I just flipped it. 
we spilled it, but it's really don't try. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So, Never let nobody stop your vision. Absolutely. <laughs> Do you feel like St. Louis has motivated you and brought the hustle out of you, you know, with your brain? Yeah, because you... It's the energy that the people bring, you know what I'm saying? And, and like, you know, like, you can have something nice, but the show me thing is still real to this day. Like, people want to see it, want to touch it. They want to say, okay, yeah, it really is that shit. Like, I'm like, you know what I'm saying? And it's just, we all got high standards here, you know what I'm saying? Like, everybody here got high standards. So they go for you to everything that's in front of that. Sacks, demons, all this stuff like this. So yeah, it, it bring it out of you and it's just like you want more, you want to give more to the scene than just the typical. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Like everybody got like the thing going right now, so it's just like it makes you want to just keep going on what you're doing. What can we expect from you in the future? Uh, so I'm dropping the second brand. Mm -hmm. I am brand. It's called Miss Amor. Got a couple samples with me. It's actually what I got. It's a sample from the next brand. Okay. Denim. I'm making denim now. You know what I'm saying? Absolutely. Wax, distress, all that, you know. So next brand then I'll possibly be opening up a store. I'm not saying it's gonna be here yet. But no, you gotta get a store in your city. You gotta get a store in your city. I don't know, man. Politics. It depends. So, we're gonna make it happen. It's gonna be more here, though. I started designing like elementary school. Mm -hmm. Oh, man. I just used to draw sneakers. Like, I used to cut some Air Force when I was middle school. I used to draw on shirts. I used to sell drawing on shirts in middle school. Like, hit 10 middle school. Me too, hit 10. And, um,. Yeah, just it started from there, and then it just made its way up. Then high school, I started actually making my own shit. Three hours later. Play the guidance, call that on. So this is a new place that I found y'all that they just brought to the city and I'm excited for St. Louis because I feel like we need more stuff to do. I often feel like I don't have enough things to do but it kind of reminds me of Pont City Market, the place that I went to when I was in Atlanta. Of course it's not that big but it's like a mini mini version of it. Um, they have like a taco shop in here. I wanted to try some tacos but they were sold out. And they have a variety of different places like an ice cream shop, they got drinks. You can bring your dog up here. I'm definitely going to come back and bring Sandy and I want to come back and do like a little girls day. Y'all know I find all the places so come check this place out. It's new and I think y'all will like it. Today is Sunday. Um, my sister's birthday was Friday so we are at the new Ruth Chris in Chesterfield and y'all when I say it is literally so cute like it's really cute in here. Um, aesthetically pleasing and I cannot wait to eat some good food. They all fancy and stuff, like they got the tablet for the menu. Feeling the vibes here. What you think you gonna get? That raspberry, rosemary, cosmo kinda sound good. Wildberry lemonade. What do you guys eat when you go um, to Ruth Chris? I kinda want some stuffed chicken or I was thinking about some lamb chops. I haven't made my decision yet. Oh, this kind of sound good too. We got grapefruit, lime, fever tree, grape soda, lemons for my water. <laughs> It's me spilling stuff on the table and I'm 10. I know what a lemon drop tastes like, okay? <laughs> you stuffed chicken for you, ma'am. 
carve. King salmon for you. Plates are 500 degrees. Please be very Thanks. careful. Some uh, potatoes for you both. Thank you. Spoons for each of you ladies. Is there anything else I can get either one of you? No, that's it. All right, enjoy. Thank you. The block is hot. She savored her drink and it's all aesthetically pleasing over there. And meanwhile, I'm here looking crazy.